All right, uh, folks, I should, uh, we've got a lot to do tonight. And I wanted to mention, summer is fast approaching. Now, it's coming on like a train that brings summer. And, um... <laughs> anyway, that means... That means that lots of people and families are going to be taking exciting summer vacations. I bet a lot of you are already planning or thinking about really fun summer vacations. Well, we here at Late Night, we want you to have fun. We want you to be safe. So we prepared tonight some helpful hints in a little segment we're going to call Late Night Travel Tips. Right, okay, uh, first of all, uh, if you're traveling overseas, try to blend in so you don't look like a tourist. That's something they really tell you to do now, because it's safer if you just blend in. If you're traveling to Egypt, you might want to dress like this. It's just a good idea, okay? Let's say you're in Russia, you may want to dress like this in Russia. It's just a way to keep them guessing. But remember, when you come back home to the good old U.S. of A, just dress how you normally dress, and you'll be fine. Everyone else does. Just smart to do that. Now, of course, uh, rich people always make really unique plans that make the rest of us jealous. For example, we all read about this. Millionaire Dennis Tito just completed his vacation in outer space for a cost of $20 million, right? Well, to top that, Bill Gates is spending Memorial Day weekend in the center of the earth. True story. <laughs> Here he is. And by that scale, he's over 8,000 miles high. Um, look at that, he's as high as Florida. We never said we drew maps to scale here. And then finally, I don't know if you know this, but this is really weird, Michael Jackson is spending three weeks inside a giraffe's belly. He's really gonna do it, look at that. He just wants to do it because he's... He's weird. <laughs> now, uh, most people have heard not to drink the water in Mexico because you get what they call Montezuma's Revenge. Well, guess what? The same holds true for other countries as well. In Italy, there's Mussolini Mayhem. True story. In Spain, there's Anal Armada. Wanna watch out for that. And in Germany, there's Kaiser Will Not Stop Going to the Bathroom. Just make sure you avoid those ones. Now, folks, here's an important tip. Sounds like a minor thing, but it's not. If you're planning on taking an electric shaver, and you're going to a foreign country, remember, the voltage is different for electric shavers overseas. That's right, you need an adapter, or you're just completely out of luck. To avoid any unnecessary confusion, use a regular razor. Just a regular, straight-edged razor. <laughs> God bless you, T. <laughs> tired of the... We'll be hearing him again, I'm sure. Uh, tired of the same old boring travel agencies that all offer the same types of vacation packages? Why not check out two live crew video vacations? Here's how it works. They're a travel agency that offers vacations based on locales that have appeared in two live crew videos. Take a look. This is the video, Pop That Coochie. It was filmed in Miami, and it's a three-day package. Does that package include any coochie? Sure does. Okay, that sounds good. Yeah. We'll take it. Yeah. Now... Now, folks, it's a really good idea to always use traveler's checks instead of cash. Okay? That's just old wisdom. And if you don't believe me, this is, this is important. Listen to NBC security guard Marcus Green. As an NBC security guard, I report dozens of lost or stolen items every summer. Like this wallet. It belonged to a man named Horn Spall, a Danish man. He had over 25,000 in Danish kroner in his wallet. Now, if he would have had traveler's checks, I wouldn't have this funky ring. Who? <laughs> I like Marcus. He's a good man. And it's a great ring. You know, when you travel abroad, it's considerate 
to uh, the local people to try to speak their language. Just a nice thing to make the effort. But you got to be careful. Americans are sometimes overconfident of their ability to communicate in a foreign language. They'll often try to say one thing, but actually say another. Yeah, yeah, um, I had seen such a how bing bow chow chow. He's out. What kind of that's a good travel tips, I believe. All right, everybody, we're going to take a uh, little break. And when we come back, Martha Stewart will be joining us.